Hey, how are you? Um, I wanted to show you my Value Village haul. Um, but first I want to announce the winner of my giveaway, the OPI nail polish set. And I don't remember how many comments I had, but I did went random.org and it came up with number five, which is Colleen Ms. Cavalier 01. So congratulations, Colleen. Uh, send me a private message. I already messaged her, but go ahead and send me a private message with your address and um, I will get that out to you as soon as I can. And I know she just had a baby grand or a grandbaby and uh, so maybe she isn't even on YouTube at this point. She's probably just so enamored with him. So congratulations on both counts, Colleen. Um, so I went to Val Value Village yesterday and I got quite a bit of stuff. I'll have to set my timer here. Um, and on Wednesday, that is Senior Citizen Discount Day. So I got 20% off of everything except for this hat. I got this for my Halloween costume. Um, it is a lady's chapeau. And it's just this round little hat with the feather and flower detail. And so that's that. Unless I wear it like this. I probably wear it like this. Um, I bought that steampunk outfit off of eBay and then, oh that was cute with my wig, not. Um, my steampunk outfit and then I ordered a pair of boots off of Hot Look or Oat Look or Hot Look, however you pronounce it. Uh, they were only $27. They zip and lace up the front and I think that they had a little strap so they were very steampunky and um, yeah. So, I have two big bags full. They had quite a bit of camo wear, and this has sold for me pretty well in the past because we have an Army base and an Air Force base. So I got um, a pair of the Army camo pants. They're button front, and then all the pockets are buttoned. These are in a size large according to Value Village. Uh, so they're large, regular, the waist is 35 to 39 inches, the inseam is 29 and a half to 32 and a half inches. Uh, so these were $6.99 and it got 20% off. I don't have the receipt here, it might be in my purse. My husband came home, I had my dental appointment this morning for my cleaning. I love my new dentist and his staff. And um... Then I had to go to the post office, and then I came home. I was home for a little bit, finished um, uploading my other video with my Mary Kay order. And then my husband came home, and then he fell asleep, so I lost some time. And now I have to go back, or go into work, because I have a client at 4.30. And I got another pair. Uh, these are uh, medium regular waist 31 to 35, inseam 29 and a half to 32 and a half. They had some of the camo rain pants, which are pretty nice. Uh, they're, they have a gore seam. Uh, where's the tag on these? It's, it's cool because they have these uh, zippers down the side of the leg. Um, I guess I'm not sure why, but they do. They're pretty cool. Um, and like I said, these sell pretty well. Oh, here, size large, and these were $5.99, and I don't know. Anyway, so those are lined with waterproof fabric. I guess this is the army camo bag because I have two more. That's what was in this bag. Then I got another jacket. This is a size medium. And I had gotten one for myself, potentially. I haven't worn it. Um, and then this one, same jacket. And the rain pants were $5.99. These were $6.99. And it says size medium also. I don't know. 
know I got two mediums. Because now I have three mediums. Maybe they didn't have larges. Anyway, so that was the Army Camel Bag. Let's get on to this bag. I found some Chico's. Um, this was really nice. This is a, a, a twin set. So it has the, the sleeveless shell. It's in black velvet. It's a size one in Chico's. And then this is the jacket that goes over it and it zips up the front. Um, so it isn't really a cardigan. It's more of a zip front, I guess. I think. Does it zip up the front? Maybe not. I don't I don't know. Anyway. So that's the jacket in the black velvet. Beautiful condition. $8.99. They put it as an XL. Whoever is doing this doesn't know Chico sizing. So that's a size one and um No, I guess it just ties around the waist, or around the, the bust line. And um, that's beautiful, a beautiful set. It's like in brand new condition. Uh, I got this top. I didn't try it on, but I thought if it fit me and it looked nice, I would keep it. Otherwise, I'll just list it. Jones, New York. Oh, I'm sorry, Jones Wear and XL. And it's this really pretty blue and tan and black. Nice little print. Um, the sleeves are sheer in places and the, uh, the bodice part, the body, is lined in black. So that's a really nice piece. Did I say how much it was? $6.99. I found another Torrid piece. These sell right away. This is so cute. This is an XL. I'm going to try it on. I don't know. I might keep it and wear it. It might be a little junior for me, but we'll give it a go. I haven't tried it on. It has the little cap sleeves and it has um, this nice collar here. So really cute. Elasticized bottom and it's sheer. But how fun. The black and white skulls. And that was $12.99. And of course I got my discount on all of these. This I got for me, but who knows. I might not wear it. I I don't know. I always think I want to wear a flannel shirt and then I typically don't. This is from The Gap Men's Size Medium. This was $6.99. I, I really like the plaid. And it's a real nice thick heavyweight cotton. So cotton flannel. How am I doing on time? Now I can't even find my phone. Oh here it is. Ah! It's buried. How are we doing here? Oh, two minutes. I'll have to do a twofer on this. This is, it looks vintage. It's a Stine, Stine Woman 2X. There's the, the tag. It looks older now. I don't know. This is silk. Um, shell 100% silk, exclusive of ornamentation. Lining is 100% polyester. A size 2x and this is beaded this is just beautiful this was only 6.99 it does have i think it's from the 80s it does have padded shoulders but this is gorgeous and it has the um what do you call it like a harlequin bottom maybe it zips up the back and has a, a hook closure up here and parts of it are sheer and it has, so the body part is lined, but the neckline is sheer. And let's see about the sleeves. No, the sleeves are, are lined, but um, a beautiful, beautiful shirt. So that's going to go on my store. It needs to be dry cleaned, which I'm not going to do. $6.99. I think that will sell easily you know especially with the holidays oh you know what i've got a hanger here i should put some of these things on the hanger oh i'm going to start the camera again and i'll be right back don't go away okay i'm back reset the 
phone. Here's another Chico's shirt. This is a size one, and again, they put it at as an XL. And this is rayon and silk. This is beautiful. There shows a little bit of wear on the cuffs, nothing major. And I guess you would expect that with it, this delicate of a fabric, but this is beautiful. Parts of it are sheer. It's a button down and it has a uh, pointed collar, uh, long sleeves, the button, and there's the back. I'll have to steam this though before I list it because it's kind of wrinkly, but isn't that beautiful? That was $7.99. These I took a gamble on. I was really on the fence about these. I thought these will either sell, somebody's going to just love them, or people are going to think, what in the world is she doing? But I found these um, MC Hammer pants. They're Venetia Sport. They're size 22-24. And they have the elastic waist here. And it has that beautiful iridescent fabric. It's in like a, a ruby burgundy shade. It has two zippered pockets on the front and long pants and then they have a little bit of cuff detail on the bottom of the leg, the outside part of the leg. So these, somebody's either going to love them or nobody's going to like them. But it was, you know, it was one of those things, well, I'll take a chance on it. It was $5.99 and uh, with the 20% off, so if they don't sell, which I think they could, because I, I might list them even, you know, as a costume type of thing. Uh, we'll see. Found another Chico's piece. This is uh, a jacket in a size 3. This was $12.99, a little more expensive, but it's a tan and brown animal print. Buttons up the front. Is that like a shirt jack? I guess it, yeah, it's a, it's a shirt jack. It's pretty boxy, and it has metal buttons. A pocket on the left side of the, the left chest. This is what it looks like. And it says it's boxy, so it's more like a shirt jacket, and it even has a pleat in the back. Long sleeves with a button. So here's the pleat in the back, right there, and it is, uh, no it isn't lined, but it's like a faux suede. Here's the inside, so you kind of get an idea of the, the fabric. I tried it on, it was too big for me, but it, it was, it looked sharp, it was a nice piece. So hopefully somebody will buy that and enjoy it. Okay, another Chico's top. This is a size 100% polyester. This would be a really nice um, staple for somebody, for somebody's wardrobe. Um, is it supposed to have a button? Oh, it has a snap here. Okay. Never mind. All right, so it snaps in the front. It's a blousey top, and it has the three-quarter sleeves and it has some nice uh, stitch detail at the neckline and then here is where it unsnaps or snaps however you want to wear it. Just really nice and lightweight and flowy. Look really pretty with a pencil skirt or um, some dress slacks. That was $8.99. I love this shirt and I, I don't know I might keep it and wear it for a while, or I might just sell it. Um, I think this is just one of the coolest things I've found. And this is obviously a more vintage, because look at the tag. It's Wrangler Western Wear for Women. And look at the pattern on this fabric. Look at this. Isn't that hilarious? It's... Uh, Cowboys lassoing. I just think it's so cool. And then it has a contrast trim at the collar, not at the cuff. And then the buttons are really neat. They have these silver buttons with the detail. Hopefully you can see that. It's just a long shirt. 
long sleeves, button down, western shirt. But what attracted me was the black and white and red, and then all the little cowboys all over it. I just love that. Did I see how much it was? $7.99. This is a Lane Bryant shirt, and again, I was on the fence about this one. Um, but it was only $6.99, and then the 20% off. It's this beautiful royal blue knit, and it is a size... 1820 and even when I was plus size sometimes I found Lane Bryant didn't their tops didn't fit me that well they were too big or something they always seem too big um, but this is beautiful it's a nice long length a nice tunic has elastic at the sleeves the white buttons and then the shearing here so this would be really cute with skinny jeans or um, pants or leggings really a nice shirt and it was only $6.99 another Chico's item it was Chico's day yesterday at Value Village in Alaska this still has the um, dry clean tag on it this is another beautiful piece it is has some sheer qualities to it and I love the colors and this is a size one, rayon and nylon. This again is like a shirt jacket. It's very boxy, it has the same pleat in the back that the animal print one did, but look at those colors. Isn't that beautiful? This would be so pretty for the holidays or even just, you know, for work. But um, gorgeous, gorgeous shirt. And I love the buttons too, very unique. So that was $6.99. And I inspect these to make sure that things are in good condition. And then I found two crafting things. I have the Stampin' Up stamp set. And does it have a date on it? $19.95. So it's $2.99, but what I liked was this one. I think that would make a really neat grass pattern. Um, if you were doing, you know, like a picture of animals or a person, you could stamp that a few times and get a really nice grass effect. And then I think I already have one of these, so if I do, I'll either send it to my daughter or I will um, put it in my store. This Fisker's um, Easter Punch. It's a cute little Easter egg, and I do believe I have that, and that was $2.99 also. So those are my little crafty items. So that was my latest Value Village haul, and I think that I got some really nice pieces, and I think that they should sell really well in the store. So, um, yeah, I think that's... I think that's it. So anyway, thanks you guys for watching. Check out your thrift stores. Um, you can get some really great pieces for really good deals. As I said, you know, Chico's, I got found several. I found a Lane Bryant, a Torrid, um, a Venetia. So you can find some decent brands. Oh, they had a, a pair of James Purse. They were like workout pants, but they were in kind of a, a cotton duck fabric. They were gray. And they were nice, except down on the bottom, they apparently had had some tabs to, so you could roll and tab up the, the, the pants. And somebody had cut those off and it just didn't look very good because where they cut it off, it was lighter and you could see that something had been done. <gasps> There's my timer. Um, so I, I passed on them. But that's the first time I've seen James Purse in the thrift store. You just never know. All right, you guys, well, thanks so much for watching again, and I'll just talk to you soon. Bye. Have a great weekend if I don't talk to you before then. Bye.